Hi guys, it's Blanca. Um, today I want to show you a little trick. Uh, I'm sure some of you have already seen it uh, around, which is basically how to make your own house cleaning wipes. Um, the instructions that I've seen were using a roll of kitchen paper, but uh, I wasn't able to find a recyclable, uh, recycled roll of kitchen table that it's uh, small enough because they were mostly pretty tall and that was not good for me uh, it was not suitable for what i want to do so what i actually decided to do was to buy this type of uh, kitchen paper and uh, this one doesn't have any dyes uh, in it and it's recyclable uh, as it says even on the paper that it's actually sugarcane based uh, and it is done so it reduces a wood consumption so for me this one was also really uh, important and then I have a container like this um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open the container and next thing that I have I'm gonna be using the teas cleaner you know I always tell you that one is fantastic because one bottle of cleaner you can clean your entire house with it. You don't have to buy any other cleaners. You can use your use it for your toilet, for your bathroom, for your floors, for your windows, uh, countertops, um, kitchen, anything and everything. There is nothing you cannot use this cleaner on. So uh, one bottle saves you shopping for like 10 different type of cleaners. So I'm going to be using that one and because I'm going to be mostly using it on cleaning uh, kitchen countertops, I'm actually going to be using two cups full, cupfuls of this. It is the strongest uh, uh, dilution that is recommended when it comes to kitchen because it really is going to help me to uh, melt all the greasy stains. And then I'm going to be using uh, Vinegar, you can see I have a big jug. Thank you, Christina. I'm still having this one from you. <laughs> one year. <laughs> so I'm going to be using a third of a cup of uh, a regular cup uh, of this one. So first what I'm going to do, I'm going to open the, I'm going to open the towels. Um, why I'm doing this is because normally when you wipe, when you buy the kitchen wipes, they are full of bleach and I don't want that. I don't want any of that uh, anywhere close to uh, where I put my food, where I touch with my hands and, and things like that. It's not good for us. So I want uh, something that is economical and ecological and it's good for us. So as you can see, this one fits in nicely here. Then I'm gonna take this. And I'm going to mix two cupfuls of this. One, two. And a third of the cup would come, third of the cup would come with the white vinegar. And the rest, I'm just going to top off with water. Yep. The rest will come with water to make it about a two cupful. If it's not going to be enough, this is my first time. This is my first time making it. And then I'm just basically going to pour this over. If it's not going to be enough, I'm just going to double because I might need to double it. Basically going to pour it over. I don't want it to be uh, full of that liquid, but on the other hand, the paper needs to soak it because they will soak up the liquid as they sit in it. Uh, I don't think I need to double it because as it's going to sit, I don't want the water to be dripping from it. So, as you can see now, it is kind of nicely. So I'm going to just press it a little bit so the liquid goes all around. 
and I'm gonna let it sit. So all the towels, the water is gonna kind of drip through all the towels. And what's gonna happen, it's gonna kind of evenly distribute the liquid. And then when I need to wipe something off, I'm just gonna pull off one. You can see I'm gonna pull off one and use that to nicely wipe kitchen uh, kitchen counters and my stove because like for me the biggest problem is with uh, having the kitchen the kitchen top and the stove uh, always clean but with something that it's healthy and it's not gonna hurt us while uh, because my food and all my ingredients uh, are touching it. So that is, and then I'm absolutely naturally gonna keep it closed in the closed container so the liquid doesn't evaporate that easily. So it was 100 yen for, it was 100 yen for the wipes and uh, the, the household cleaner, uh, comes to about 30 yen per cupful uh, so I put two so 60 yen so all these wipes cost me I don't know how much you can count for the the little bit of uh, of uh, apple cider vinegar but so I would say maybe 170 yen for this whole thing and it's gonna last me forever uh, so I hope you like this try it at home let me know okay Bye.